It's every small business owner's nightmare, and you're watching it unfold on surveillance video obtained by KCRA3. On Wednesday morning, someone smashed in the doorframe at Empire's Comics Vault in Sacramento. You can see the burglar make his way through the store, grabbing items and putting them in a bag. He then forces his way through a back door. So he, you can see the... <laughs> Where he bashed it. Store owner Ben Schwartz showing us some of the damage. The entire break in happened in under 60 seconds, but caused thousands of dollars in damages. Does this feel tiring for you, just having to experience these break ins over and over again? It most definitely does. This is the fourth time in five years someone has broken into the shop. The last thing any small business owner needs in the middle of the pandemic. We've just spent the last year and a half holding the place together, keeping things from going under, making sure that we're able to stay in business. And as things are starting to get back to normal, somebody breaks in. And we also know that the comic book store is not the only store in this plaza that that burglar broke into. Behind me is the Pizza Hut, where you can see the plywood set up there. That's where the burglar tried to enter. It's just really upsetting. Loyal customers stepping into their superhero shoes. Alfonso Jimenez cut the store a check he hopes will help with some of the losses. It's just unfortunate that someone would feel that they could victimize um, you know, a small business. It totally broke my heart. Comic book fan Jen Monson has been shopping here with her husband since 2015. It's one of those questions that comes to your mind like, who on earth would do this to a small business? Hoping her voice can help turn the page to a better outcome for a store that's been here for nearly two decades. I love that Empires has made it this far in, you know, past the, the bulk of the pandemic. If he wasn't here, I mean, it would leave a huge hole. And back out here live, if you want to play Superman or Wonder Woman and help rescue this business from this very difficult and disappointing situation for them, you can always come down to 1120 Fulton Avenue and pick up a comic book or two. Reporting live from Sacramento, Stephanie Lynn, KCRA 3 News. Stephanie, of course, it's so good to hear that customers are already supporting that business. Thanks a lot for that live report.